I'm Eric Anderson, field crops educator with Michigan State University Extension in Southwest Michigan. I want to talk to you about a pest in soybean that you may not be familiar with, and that is voles. A vole is a rodent pest similar to a field mouse in size. It's quite a bit smaller than a gopher and slightly smaller than a mole. Voles are four to six inches long with short, stocky bodies, short legs and short tails, small eyes with ears partially hidden, and they're typically brown or gray. Voles can have five to 10 litters per year, averaging three to five young per litter, so populations can increase quickly. Vole populations tend to increase every three to five years on a boom-bust cycle. Mild winters with good snow cover can increase populations and, as with any animal, increasing availability of a food source and limiting predator access will also favor higher populations. They prefer areas with a heavy ground cover and construct many surface runways or shallow tunnels in dense grass with numerous burrow entrances, so it's easier to find signs of their presence than to actually see them. Voles eat a wide variety of plants, most frequently grasses and forbs. In late summer and fall, they store seeds, tubers, bulbs, and rhizomes. Fields that are more susceptible to vole damage include those under no-till and those that had dense cover crop late into the spring. This field is in a corn-soybean rotation under conservation tillage practices. The voles fed on the soybean here at the cotyledon stage. They have assumedly continued feeding on the plants throughout the summer, but similar to light deer feeding, soybean can handle the grazing with little impact. This particular patch has only one entrance hole, although other patches in this field have as many as six in a similar sized area. Here you see vole burrows in a row, in this case under last year's corn residue, which is not uncommon. These patches can usually be distinguished from groundhog feeding as there will not be a large hole and surrounding mound if in the middle of a field or a large, often semicircular patch of feeding if near the edge of a field. Here is a false color plant health image of the field shown before with red indicating bare ground, most of which was due to vole feeding. This particular field had 10 to 15 percent of the area under the center pivot that was taken out by vole feeding. When scouting this fall, or as you are harvesting, look for these irregularly shaped voids in the field. If you live in Michigan and you suspect you're seeing vole damage, feel free to contact me by phone or email.